Hello all. In today's video, I will show you how to calculate area in the topographical map. I have taken one question for you. Calculate the area enclosed by Eastings 15 to 20, Northings 04 to 11 in kilometer square. All of us know in mathematics, area is equal to length into breadth. But in the topographical map, we don't write length and breadth, but we write Eastings and Northings. I have circled this for the to show the difference. Instead of L and B, we write ES and NS. In the given question, Easting is given 15 to 20. We will see in the map. From 15, it will start, it will end at 20. So how many grids we will count? 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. So we will write here 5 grids. In the same way, northing is 0, 4 to 11. We will check in the map from where it is starting 0, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. All together 7 grids. So we will write 7 grids here. Area is equal to easting and northing. Instead of easting and northing, we have written Five, I have written 5 into 7, 35 grids. We know that the area of one grid is 1 kilometer squared in this topographical map. Therefore, the area of 35 grids will be 35 kilometer. This will be your answer. This was very simple way of calculating area. Suppose the question comes, calculate the area in the topographical map, only the part which is shaded, shaded part. Then how we will me do measurement? First step, we will write the number of complete squares. We will count 1, 2, 3, 4, we will write. Then the area of complete squares will be 4 kilometer square. Second, we will see number of half squares. One, half 1, 2, 3 and 4. Again, then the area of half squares will be 2 kilometer square. Third, we will count the number of 2 by 3 squares here. Again, 1, 2, 3 and 4. Then the area of 2 by 3 squares will be 2.6 kilometer square. Last, number of 1 third squares we will count. Very small part. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. Then we will write 5 here and then the area of 1 third squares will be 1.6 kilometer. I have circled all this to make it clear that for the total area, we will add all these four areas and after adding, we are getting 10.2 kilometers square. This will be your answer. So I'm sure that the topic calculation of area in different two conditions is clear to you. If you enjoy, then like and leave your valuable comments. If you are new to this channel, then please subscribe. Thank you.